All right, guys, so the other day I ran E15 in this, and I was like, ah, it's going to kill it, blah, 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 forums, all that good stuff. So I did do the YD100 build where I modified it to run off straight ethanol. And that is the exact same carb right there. It has a 1.2 millimeter main and a 90 pilot in it. Uh, we're running E85 with ethanol oil. Um, it's like Mo, I, I forget the name of that company, but I'll put it in the description. It's just for ethanol, I think uh, track racer bikes for two stroke ones. And then what I did is I took the head gasket and the bottom gaskets off, bottom end gaskets there. And I just put one bottom end gasket because this is a double stacker. And on the top I used a very thin head gasket. It's about the thickness of an aluminum can, really. So I had that all cut out, put it all on, put it all back together. My squish value is basically just about the tap it's like 0.3 millimeters or something crazy now in this i changed the plug already went over jet sizes same reed valve setup and we're gonna try and run it for the first time so let's see how this goes uh if it's anything like the last one it should be loud as hell as uh you know, eh, it's just ethanol. Uh, the other thing, too, a note on this. I wanted to try this because right now, E85 uh, per gallon is $2.10. So, if I can run that in that, that is half the price of my gas right now down here. Because we are at $4.05 already. So, half the price. Let's see if it runs. Uh, if you watch the other videos I did you'll uh understand the whole mechanics of this but this will be the second one we're gonna give this a try i've not even started it yet so here's the first go let's see what the heck happens oh man those are squeaky all right Maybe we'll take this down the uh, backwoods trail because this thing gonna be loud. All right, here we go. Oh yeah. Yeah, it sounds just like the YD100. Oh yeah. Yeah, it sounds just like the YD100. Oh yeah, that's gonna be so pissing me to Good lord. Yeah, it is not warmed up yet. This shit is loud. <laughs>
KFC idols. Town. I hate the smell of that kit. Boy, it's got a loud pop to it. Woo! Getting fumigated. Okay, let's see what happens at the high end. This thing is freaking throaty. <laughs> I gotta put that, uh, forgot to put the damn uh, filter second stage on. Wow, this thing. Alright, take it to the end and home. Wow, there is a lot of torque to this. Definitely a screamer. Oh! <laughs> Holy shit! I don't know if you guys heard that, but that thing was just screaming. <laughs> you also gotta realize I balance that crank and stuff like perfectly, so. 
I don't think a stock one crank would do that. Hey, look at that. I got it to idle. First shot. Had, tr had trouble with it last time, idling. That's nah, good. It's crazy. That's an off shit for sure. It's fun. Guys, you gotta see this. Look at the freaking road. <laughs> it's spinning that tire so fucking crazy. It's actually leaving a line down the freaking road here. It never does that. <laughs> That's so funny. gonna run this good first go. Started. Now I got a second to catch my breath. So that was the first run of this. Looks like we got a little bit of an exhaust leak there. That's okay. It's the first time that seal. I like, probably got to just set it. Everything else looks good. So what happened was I ran out of fuel. <laughs> I put a quarter tank in that. And that's the one thing too, especially at where I had that at. That thing literally was doing like a rolling burnout the entire time. That was crazy. I have a 44 tooth on that. That thing was way over 12,000 RPM. Easily. If it's like the other one easily now that crank is super balanced because I, that was well, when i rebuilt that 
<clears throat> so those two are matched really well the piston to that um what else so yeah the plug changed the squish value i mean it's at like 0.2 millimeters or something crazy small like that and um the spark plug i actually had to raise up with a uh, brass uh, gasket even just to make sure it didn't tap it but uh, yeah that was super freaking crazy um, wow this could be fun but yeah I ran straight C85 in this with that uh, ethanol race oil stuff and like I said earlier I'll link that in the description but this is just a gas engine I changed the squish value put a hotter plug in and pretty much I'm just running some monster jets I actually had to drill them out and make them which I did in the other video so, so that thing is sucking some fuel but <laughs> amazing all right peace out guys